Good morning, clan. Welcome once again to Washington, D.C. We're here at the airport a little early, getting checked in. Unfortunately, when I tried to check in yesterday to our flights, uh, we couldn't pick our seats. The seats were already picked for us, and the kids are like, by themselves, we're by ourselves, we're across the plane, like we're completely scattered across the plane. So we're here a little early to try and see if we can get some better seats. At least try to get these two to sit next to each other so that when they fall asleep they can fall asleep on each other's shoulders. Because uh, the flight to the flight from Florida, you were sitting with a stranger. <laughs> you were sleeping next to a stranger. Yeah. I don't think people fall asleep as it's not asleep. That's true. That's yeah. true. We'll try to avoid that anyways. Made it through security and Sierra's laptop got flagged. They had to check it for explosives. You're clear, right? No explosives? We're clear. She's not carrying explosives. Does that scan it just for explosives? They they scan like they, they they check all the like the corners of like all the angles of anything that could be opened that you could have like stuck something in. So that's why you scan like all the like the battery, the sides, all that stuff. Anytime they do like those kind of like checks or scans or when you read a law or a rule that says you can't do this, you can't do that, or you can't have this, you can't, it always makes you think like that means that somebody tried that. Either it worked, right, or they tried it and got caught. And so now it's like a law or now it's like standard procedure to like check that kind of stuff. It's kind of scary. Uh, What's for lunch? Kidoba. Uh, Kidoba. 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 Starving. I know. It's like the Late lunches, man. Late lunches. Yeah. All right. So it's Tuesday, which means tacos. It's Taco Tuesday. We got some crunchy tacos. We got some soft tacos. The kids got some uh, bowls. What? The table would be awesome. The table would be awesome, but there's no tables, so we're literally sitting in the air, air, uh, airport seats, which sucks, especially eating tacos. <laughs> Kids are holding up okay, though. How was your Taco Tuesday in the airport? You just inhaled this food. <laughs> you didn't even like, you, you're like, I was gonna mush the tacos up, no, make a taco salad out of it. The third one got a little yeah. soggy. Yeah, no, that's the only problem with crispy tacos, that, like the meat gets soggy. Yeah. Price is scraping this bowl. I know. The only problem with tacos is that you don't get quite as much food as you do like in a burrito or burrito bowl because they didn't get your rice or beans. Okay? I almost wish I should have like said add some beans to my tacos, but they're so small you can't put too much food in them. You, can't, you, know, you know how I make my tacos at home, guys? Like they're overflowing, they're bursting. Great traveling to Houston. Please come forward. Active military. Thank you for your service. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and you are welcome to board at this time. <laughs> How can my videos like that? Because you don't play funny games, you're not that funny. Yeah, boarding group one, welcome aboard. You play, you don't play funny games, so that's all. Is it the game or is it him? Game both. and him. I don't both. know. Both. And, uh, and this is the thing. It's an accent, it's an accent. Like when he says Oh, so I need an accent. I need, I need to talk like an Irishman. <laughs> All right, we made it to Denver first time. However, oh wait, this is my this is my, my first time. I've been here with my dad. Never mind. <laughs> But we're not leaving. We're not leaving the airport. That's why the thing when you, we have these connecting flights and stuff, you don't actually uh, get to explore the city. We're here for like 45 minutes and then we hop on another plane back to Phoenix. How's that flight? Good? You took a nap? Yeah. What'd you do, mommy? One and a half movie. One and a half movie? Yeah, we'll call that. What'd you do? One and a half movie. One and a half movie. One and a half movie. We honestly didn't even have time to grab a snack or anything. Everyone already boarded the plane without me. I had to grab water and some trail mix and stuff. I have my G Fuel, yo, my G Fuel. The longest causeway, too. Holy crap.
back in Phoenix, what? What? In the PHX. We're not, we're not like home home, we're in the hometown. Drive. So literal, he's always so literal. Yes, we're back in Phoenix. Jeez, gosh, it's a weird terminal though. This is not a terminal we normally like get into. This is terminal three, I think, or terminal two. I don't know, like, I, this is not look familiar at all. The entire walkway was different than what we're normally used to. But now we gotta go wait for our bags. And then we get an Uber. And then we get Tiffany's car. And then we drive home. But you don't need an Uber this time. Oh, we parked, that's right. That's right, oh my gosh. Did I tell you that, you that in the vlog? I don't know guys, we cut it too close. There was way too much traffic on the way here. And so we made a decision to park here at the airport and pay $25 a night to long-term so, parking. It's ridiculous, it's a rip-off, and it kind of bothers me. <laughs> and now you're gonna say, no, cut that out. <laughs> yeah, that's what mommy says, huh? Cut that out, Clay, cut, cut that out. She doesn't and I always, I, I always leave it in, like, cut it out. Anyways, what I was gonna say was, it would've been cheaper for us to take an Uber from home to the airport. Nine times out of 10 though, we just drive to Papa's work and leave our car at Papa's work because we had the option to do that. But this time we didn't get the option. We paid for long-term parking and it sucks. Like $125? $150, just for parking. I don't know. Oh, I gotta get the dog. I forgot about that. I forgot. I forgot. I'm, I'm, man, I forgot that. I'm like, oh yeah, one more thing. I want to go and play the new Black Ops, but it's getting late. Oh, the DLC? Yeah. And Battlefield 1, too. Yeah, well, yep, let's get to school tomorrow. You guys, looking, you, you look forward to school tomorrow? We, no, we have one hour. We can stay up until 10 o'clock. Are you excited to go back to school tomorrow? No! Did you do all your reading? No. Nope. Tisk, tisk, tisk. You did all your homework, right? Actually, no. I, put in, I did my science, and then the math reading, I said I had no assignments. Oh, okay. So I'm going to tell my teachers that they told me to do those assignments, and so I went on there yesterday. On where? Online? Um, yeah, um, yeah, online on these websites, and it says your teacher has no assignments for you. It's like, uh. Next stop, turn. Call oh, race. Thank you for visiting Phoenix Sky Harbor International Airport. Just dropped off Tiff and the kids home, grabbed some uh, late dinner, and I'm here to pick up Baby from the pet hotel. She's gonna be super excited. Oh, if you want my leash. <laughs> I was gonna say, she's gonna be super excited to see us. Hopefully. It's kinda late though, it's like 9.30. 9.30. Well, that's it guys. We're back home, safe and sound. Everyone's in bed, and uh, I'm calling her tonight. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed those Washington, D.C. videos. And let me know in the comments down below your favorite one. What was your favorite thing that we did? Was it Playlist Live thing? Was it a uh, personal family thing? Let me know, and we'll see you tomorrow. My name's Hunter, and I'm from Rice Lake, Wisconsin, and vlog on.